just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them as can still handle it. Thanks. Keep them off us! I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up! They're gonna be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told, Dan. Ugh. Hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur. He was like... Like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And did we... What about the, the money? Lost somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. It's the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait, you're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Rono Grids and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah, seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead, too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And... Uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... Might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. The Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. Huh. Guess not. Jimmy. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And? When Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. 
You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Arthur? Arthur? Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, we ain't done yet, Abigail. Dutch seems... To have lost his mind? I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I... I have you as a friend. Hey there. Hey. Why don't you lay off the bottle for a bit? Why don't you lay off me? I'm only concerned. Yeah, yeah. But what? Everything. This. This cannot go on. How many more times will we survive? These past months have been hellish. A whole lot of trouble. For no real reason. Trouble for those who deserve it always seemed reason enough for Dutch. Problem is, I ain't sure he cares who he's fighting no more. You can't kill everyone. So, now what are the pair of you scheming Mr. about Morgan. now, huh? You goddamn traitors. How are you feeling about Molly? You? I'm feeling you she got exactly what she deserved. When he found you. That's what I think. He believed in you when no other son of a bitch would. And him? You ain't been nothing but a bad apple from the start. You ain't even been with us a full year, and you think you know better. And you? Well, you're the lowest of the lot. Ungrateful sons of bitches. All of you. You'll get what's coming to you. He's too dumb to see it for how it is. He's loyal. I'll give him that. Loyal and stupid. What the hell was that about? Bill, being too dumb to see the woods for the trees? Uh, he's just taking it hard, I think. Okay, well, let's talk more later. All right then, Arthur. Yep. Gotta help anyone tries to get past you. Hey, Arthur. Just keep your ear to the ground. I will. You okay? What is happening to us? Just make this place work, Pearson. For now.
horse there. Hello, sir. This must be your first time. I have a good selection of quality weaponry in the catalog here. And anything you like, I can bring out for you. Let me know what you'd like. That's a good choice. You know, a new stock on this could really improve you. Interested? Very good. Ah. Have you considered improving the sights on this weapon? It makes a big difference. This is an excellent weapon. I hear there was a big shootout with the Murphy gang in the caves at Beaver Hollow.
Thank you for your help. Time we went on. Hey, you there. Can I have a walk? Good evening, friend. Wait a minute. Is that who I think it is? Been a long time. What can I do for you? Now, oh, let's have a look. Carry it with pride. Yep, this is the one. It does seem strange to me that they'd need so many guards of Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tom. Must be something else going on there. testing this out. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. Like you've been on whiskey and no stew. You all right? I've been better, but I'm okay. All right, well, let me know what you need. 
Thanks. That's fire. Mind if I warm my bones? <laughs> Y'all knew this was Murphy Hills. You should be careful where you're camping. I can look after myself. Besides, it's a free country. Free country? <laughs> no. Everything bought and paid for. <laughs> and we're gonna protect what's ours. Y'all be careful where you wander. Come on, let's go. I think you got the message. Go kill you next time. <laughs>
Help a blind man. Easy, whoa. 